Hello. John Bateman, welcome back to Bradford Bulls. How's it feel to be back where it all began? Uh, yeah, it's good, mate. It's, obviously, I haven't, I haven't been here for a few, few years now, and it's good to come back and see the place and obviously be here for a while. I've played for many years, mate. It's fantastic. Uh, you made your debut in the Challenge Cup against Halifax, obviously, with a big game around the corner for Bradford. So, what are your memories of that year, of that day? Yeah, well, it was a pretty good, good debut, obviously. We played, at, played at Halifax at one. I think we went, back, went behind at one point. And, you know what I mean? We managed to pull the game back, so it was just a fantastic memory for myself. Obviously, pulling on, pulling on the shirt, what I wanted to do for many, many years, and seeing my family there when I did so. So it was fantastic, man. And playing in the Challenge Cup, obviously, quite a prestigious competition. What did that mean for you? Yeah, it's obviously we, I got, got a chance to run out of Wembley. Didn't really go away for, for when I played, and we didn't really get the trophy. But it was fantastic, man. For you, you know what I mean? It's something as a kid that you always want to do, and you grow up watching. BBC for many years and seeing the Challenge Cup being played on there. It's one of them things you really want to do and obviously to get to, to get to get to win out at Wembley was a fantastic thing but it would been even better to win it but it's, at least I've still got the memories. And Bradford Halifax is quite a big derby, you only played in the one but did you feel the intensity of the derby in that day? Um, yeah obviously, literally around the corner is Halifax and it's one of them games you really want to win and you really want to put a mark down type thing so obviously the boys, the Bradford boys would be wanting to do that as well. Obviously they've just beaten Leeds, I'm sure you were watching in Australia. How did that feel watching your old uh, your old team beat the old rivals? Yeah, well I just I landed the morning of, of the game to fair mate, so I managed to watch it over here and I said watch it on BBC with me with me, with my mum and that and my grandma came to the game so it was a fantastic game mate. It's obviously to, to play against Leeds which which you haven't done for years but then to get the result in the Challenge Cup you can't really ask for much more even even from a Bradford lad it's, it's great to watch and I spoke to Elliot over in Australia and he was buzzing as well, so it's, it's, it was fantastic to watch. And to see Oddsall bouncing again, it brings back some great memories. Yeah, definitely. I've played in front of some great crowds here at Oddsall. And I've also been on the other side as well, playing for Wigan against some good crowds here. And we lost as well for Wigan when we played here, so it really, it really takes it back to the good old days of as a kid, I used to come here and watch watch some games, and we used to have what well, used to have 15, 20,000 at games, and it was a fantastic atmosphere. And it's great to see them days back again. Obviously, you played on the biggest stages. What message do you have to the players who were looking to play in their first sort of semi-final, the biggest games of their career? If they beat Halifax, it's a massive game. Yeah, like you said, it's they need to win this game to obviously to go into the semi-final. And a bit, it's, I just want to say it's. It's one of them games where just don't, just don't let it pass you by, mate. It's, you might not get to play many of these games, so just enjoy every minute of it. But if it, if it, just do what you need to do, if it, whatever it takes to win the game, what it takes, that, and just go make sure you go full out, and go all out, and give it all. And like I said, just don't let it pass you by, because you might be sat there in ten years' time thinking, why didn't I do this? Why didn't I do that? But just make sure you go out there and get the result, but enjoy it mostly. It could be a first semi-final for the club since 2007. What do you have to say to the Bradford supporters who've started to come back and witness this great cup run? Yeah, just just get behind the team. Why won't they? You know what I mean? The, the, the city, I'd probably say, needs it more than anything else. And the club as well. It's fantastic to see the club getting back to the heights of where, obviously, 2007 where they should be. And just get behind the boys. The boys will love it. It's like I said, the. The crowd that we got here for Leeds probably played a massive, massive impact on the game and the, way, the, the result that we got. And the, if more people can get behind the team, it's fantastic for the team and hopefully they get the result again.